Hello everybody and good morning. Welcome to another video, another week. Um, today we're working on a few projects. Um, I'm going to break them up into different videos here, but they are uh, just little tiny projects I need to get done. Um, today's project will be working on the stock tank that Project Turtle gave me. Go ahead and follow him if you haven't already. He has his own channel. And um, pretty much there's a gash in the stock tank, so I'm going to try to patch it and hopefully uh, it'll hold a little bit of water again. Um, and then I also need to work on a worm bin. That way my box rolls have a supply of worms. I used to have a worm bin and then it ended up, uh, ended up dying, drying out. And then I'm going to set up the solar panel today. Some shade for the box turtles. It's been overcast lately, so the shade's on the end of the list, but definitely needs to get done before summer. But yeah, let's see what we get done today. Let's start on the stock tank. All right, guys, thanks for uh, joining me. Um, don't forget to hit the like, subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, thanks for all the support, guys. And uh, let's get this project going. All right, guys, here's um, the stock tank that I was given. As you can see, there is a hole in it right here. So I'm hoping maybe I can seal it, hopefully. Let's just check one of the tortoises. Here's a California Desert tortoise. Uh, Project Turtle also gave me. I guess it was his neighbors. His neighbor ended up moving. And now Project Turtle's moving, so I have them. We'll uh, make sure they're fed and drinking, eating and growing. And then I'm going to find them homes. Here's Dolly, the Texas tortoise. The box turtles are pretty quiet today. I don't have their stream going because I think there is a a leak somewhere so I'm gonna have to find where it's at and then I'm gonna have to fix it I think it's down on this end though but anyway sorry a little detour let's get back to the stock tank so anyway you can see this uh gash here and then I got some uh putty somewhere that I'll use and uh hopefully it will hold in the back Yeah. Doesn't look like too big. I mean, it's a pretty big gash, but it looks like I can get it back together. I'm going to go ahead and clean it and sand it real quick here. And then we'll uh, get the putty going. Alright, guys. Clean the area with a little bit of water and a little bit of alcohol. Now, what I want to do is actually... Let me set this camera up a little bit. So you guys can kind of see what's going on. So what I want to do is use the sandpaper. I'm just roughing it up so the putty has something to stick to if that makes sense. It's a smooth surface. The smooth surface will probably still work, but this way we know for sure it's going to kind of bond to it instead of bonding to a smooth surface. So I recommend cleaning it, use alcohol if you have it, um, and then sandpaper it. Wipe it down again. So that should be good. The type of putty I got was some marine putty here, some PC marine. I think PC11. I think that's what it is. I'm not sure. But uh hopefully it works. Going to uh, clean this off real quick. And then we're gonna open the putty. See how much we need. I think I'm gonna put some on the inside, and if we have enough, I'm gonna put another patch on the outside. And then we're gonna hope it dries and holds water. If it does, I'm gonna make a water garden out of this, I think so. Should be a pretty cool watering garden. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, wipe this down real quick one more time. Alright, I'm actually sitting inside the tub here. But uh, this thing has a 15 minute work time, so it's pretty, that's a good amount of time here. So you can see I dried it off, cleaned it. Um, this thing can actually cure underwater, so 
Um, doesn't have to be super dry or anything, but mine's all the way dry. I'm gonna cut off a piece. Got some gloves on so it doesn't, it's not too sticky on my fingers and get all over the place. I'm gonna cut off a piece. I'm not sure how much I need. And uh, we're gonna start working it and see if we can at least get it kind of kind of patched here all right wish me luck guys all right guys I ended up cutting off a little chunk here I'm not sure how much I need to use so I'm gonna start with a little bit and then we're going to uh, you just want to mix this up until it's a uniform color so it should be all white it should take about a minute it says and then you have about 15 minutes before it gets like extra extra you can see it's not super sticky but it does get all over your fingers here too so I'm not gonna be able to touch my camera really so just bear with see it's all one color almost it's kind of what you want I end up having to use all of it, but we'll see. And then the consistency is like Play Doh. Alright. So I think it's pretty good. So what I'm gonna do is just kind of roll it over like this. And then we're gonna kind of smash it in there. Make sure it's clogging most of it, and I'm just gonna smash it. I'm gonna end up putting, putting rubber over it, like a flex, not flex seal, but almost like a flex. It's gonna be rubber. I think I have rubber spray somewhere. But, uh,. That's pretty much it. I'm gonna end up using all of it, it looks like, which is fine, what I bought it for. You can see it comes in a roll like this, and then you just kinda, these caps here, just kinda keep it from probably going bad. Stuff was like six bucks or something, the hardware store. I went to a local hardware store, but I'm sure you can get it anywhere. This stuff cures in an hour only too. Or like other boxes will take 24 hours or more i'll probably wait longer just to be safe but this thing will actually cure underwater and stuff so uh i've never tried it myself but i've heard good things about it so just so it's really held in there you know so let's go ahead and just get this down you can see there's no color in there so it's good All right, we're just gonna smash it down there. I'm not sure if you guys can see it. Sorry, I don't want to touch the camera too much. Thanks, Project Turtle, for the the tub as well. If you haven't already, go visit him. He's on Instagram and on uh, YouTube, and he actually took in my turtle jaws. Who I have previous videos of, but he's going to uh, keep them and hopefully uh, the teacher breed them, which would be super cool. I'm gonna keep an eye out females for him. Charles is one of my baby boys, so I'm happy he went with him. <laughs> I think that's pretty much it, guys. Um, for application, anyway. 
Just making sure there's a pretty decent seal on it. I'm sure once it cures, it'll be really solid, you know. So, uh, take the gloves off. You can see there's the, the patch there. I'm gonna actually go to the hardware store and put another patch on the other side. I'll save you guys the hassle and not show you it, but it's gonna be the same process as this side. And then I'm gonna wait a few hours and uh, show you guys the finished product here. Hopefully it holds some water. All right guys, go ahead and uh, I'm gonna hit the store here. All right guys, here's just a little update. It's been a few hours since the patches went in. As you can see, it's got a lot sunnier since the morning, but uh, it's been in for about two or three hours. You can see it's pretty hard now already. I ended up going and uh, patching the other side as well. And then hopefully it holds water. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put water in it probably a little bit later tonight. I'll try getting on video. We're gonna let it sit there for overnight, maybe a few nights just to see if it holds. If it does, and then we'll proceed. Anyways guys, I'm here uh, starting for the trucks, the trailers. There's a lot of them, but uh, we're just inside the shade here, so it's a little shady. But anyway, thanks for joining me on this project. It's a pretty quick video. I'm going to have another quick video, another uh, quick project on my three-toe box drone enclosure and North American wood adding shade. But uh, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss them. And join me on the next one, guys. Thanks. See you on the next video.